Hey loves, welcome in to the channel. I hope everybody is having an amazing day. Let's go ahead and do a short and sweet. I'm going to raise this camera up just a little and then bam, so y'all can be able to see the cards. I hope everybody's having a good day. I hope everyone is feeling good, getting proper rest, feeling amazing, feeling abundant. Let's go ahead and tune in. Thank you, angels and spirit guides. Most high. Give us a message for this short and sweet for my viewers. You could be contemplating your next move. I feel like you should know that it's already set up for you to win. Okay. Um, there's also a, I, I see they're contemplating their next move. Okay. Looks like you want to make your next move your best move. And you will. I could see that. Whatever you're about to do or planning to do, viewer, as the chosen, as a high vibration or from a high vibrational space. It's going to be a level up for you. You may have to put yourself out there. Okay. You may need to be put, you may, you may need to get on the scene or put yourself out there. Okay. For this next move. All right. Thank you, angels and spirit gods, for clear and precise messages. What's the short and sweet for my viewers? Short and sweet for my viewers on today. Okay, we got the nine of wands coming out on the reverse. Okay, nine wands reversed. You're coming out of um, some type of trauma. Maybe getting over some drama. Okay, looks like you're getting over it. All right, things are balancing out. Six of pentacles, six of cups. We got six, six energy here. Looks like you're, 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 you're realigning yourself or the energy is what's realigning, okay? As you're coming out of battle. I'm hearing coming out of battle, okay? Six of Wands. Looks like you have victory in this battle. The Page of Swords, okay? You could be gaining some new enlightenment or getting some new downloads, receiving some new information. There's something that you're learning New. You could have a beginner mind as you come out of this battle. You're like, I learned something new while I was in battle, or I learned something new as I went through some growing pains, or I learned something new, I saw something new. There could also be someone watching you, okay, with the Page of Swords. That could also be a spy energy. You have an audience, I feel. <laughs> as you come out of battle, as things are balanced out, um, as you receive some sort of fulfillment possibly just enjoying some downtime some play time doing something fun that you love okay um it's a vibe you could be self-loving on yourself as well just taking some time out to love on you it's like you have an audience okay the empress people are watching you be great seven of pentacles There's an offer on its way to you. The Ten of Cups. Excuse me. The Strength card. This could make you or someone else very happy. This could make your child happy. This could be some good news, like your child could give you some good news. This could be a spirit baby giving you some good news. This could be an actual Leo receiving good news or giving you some good news. You're going to receive some form of an apology or like somebody's like kneeling, okay? Somebody's taking a knee here or someone's been defeated. Five of swords, someone's been, someone's betrayal. Someone tried to betray you, but they see you're still shining. You're still winning. 
it didn't work. Something about a seed somebody planted, some type of obstacle or a trap they plotted or planned for you. Like you're victorious over this. They didn't, it didn't, it didn't trap you. The Knight of Wands. You were on somebody's ass. So as this warrior here, it's like, oh my God. <laughs> Somebody thought they were lapping you. Somebody thought they were ahead of you, but the truth is you're about to lap them. You're ahead of somebody here and you're on their ass. They're just getting started or they're just, they're headed towards, they're headed towards some type of sabotage. But you're on their ass. Something's about to bite somebody in the ass. It's like this knight. Can y'all see this? Yeah. This knight right here. This is you. You're the warrior. This empress warrior. Okay. Um, it's one giving wonder warrior vibes. All right. But it's a vibe where somebody out here, they tried to betray you. They tried to plot something here with the seven of pentacles. They, 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 they wanted you wounded, but it didn't work. See, the scales are balanced in your favor here. You could be, like I said, nurturing on yourself or doing things that you love or enjoy or doing whatever your energy is calling for you to do right now. It's like you're nurturing your inner child, okay? But you're in the spotlight. You have an audience with the page of swords. You could be watching um, like documentaries or enjoying uh, movies you haven't seen before you're watching or doing i feel like you're watching something you haven't seen before so are your enemies so is the ops the ops are seeing you win they're seeing you as the empress the real true divine feminine and it's this vibe here where whatever seeds they plotted with the ten of cups here this could have been in your dream state this could have been against your spirituality or your gifts or something like that against your divinity okay because uh, i'm drawn heavy to a pisces energy <clears throat> But it's a vibe where whatever seeds they tried or obstacles or slowdowns that they planned for you, you're victorious over them. You're receiving good news. This is good emotional satisfaction here, okay? With the strength card, I feel like you're strong, stronger than, than whatever this betrayal was. And you stood up against whatever this energy was. Whoever this is, they're going to be coming to you with an apology or either they're having to take some sort of a knee. Because whatever they tried back here with these seven of pentacles, it didn't work. So now here you are on their ass. See, they thinking that they were ahead of you. They thinking that they had laid out this plan ever so gently and that it was going to trap you. Everything was going to go perfect, but it did not. It did not go in their favor. So basically what ended up happening is now they're headed towards the same trap that they set for you with the five of swords. They were trying to sabotage you in some type of way, but you're on their ass. And the only way you can be on their ass in this position is because you have already lapped them and you're coming back around to them. And here you are, you're the one that's about to, about to bite somebody in the ass. It's like your energy or, or something, it's your energy. You're a warrior. It's like you're about, you are defeating this person that's in here with this five of swords energy with the knight of cups. They are going to be sorry for whatever this seven of pentacles was that they tried to plot with the nine of wands. They tried to come at it originally that nine of wands had to have been in the upright, right? So it's a vibe that it's not now. So you're not the wounded warrior. As a matter of fact, you out here balanced in a mug. So, and you're in the six of wands. So you're victorious over this. There's something that you've survived. I feel like you've survived an attack. Okay. King of swords is out here. That's the truth. You survive some form of an attack. It's like you you cut it smooth off. Like you cut it off. You cut something off at the head. Now the body's about to fall. Oh. Oh. Yeah. There was somebody. Some two, two, two. There's some people that tried to collaborate against you to cause you some type of loss. But it's a vibe where you're cutting them off. If you cut the head off. You took the hell the head. You took the hell. You took the head off the beast. Okay. So naturally, if you cut the head off of something, the body's gonna follow. The body's gonna fall. So this could have been two to three people. The three of wands. Now this door is open. This is a door to your victory. This is a door to the scales being balanced. This is a doorway to, to ten of cups. It's ultimate happiness.
You took the head off of something and the body's about to fall. Short and sweet. Oh, okay. We got the devil in the reverse. So it looks like you took the head off of somebody who was toxic with the king of swords. The king of swords, that's a winner. The king of swords is somebody who done been through the fire, hell, and survived. So there's something that you recently went through. Like I said, you could have been getting over some type of, you know what I mean? Coming out of some type of wounded energy. It's something you've gotten over here. You've taken the head off of something. I'm hearing you took the head off the snake. Uh, somebody was doing something for clout because I feel like that's a song. That's a song. It's a title. When I said that you took the head out the soul, it's the soul. You took the soul out the snake. The head off the snake or the soul out the snake. Anyway, I'm drawn to those lyrics from that song, um, Clout, or They Do Anything for Clout by Cardi B and Offset. When he says, I took this out of the snake, okay? So you have, you've, uh, you done took the head off of this snake. Or you done took the soul out this snake. You defeated this snake. You're stronger than this snake. Your past life gifts really kicked in and whatever battle this was, you done came up out of victoriously. They got people looking at you like you that, you that, <laughs> you that MF, okay? You that one, the one. We got the hair fine. You didn't do it alone. God did it with you. Eight of Cups. God was right there. Every move you made, God was stepping with you. Big step for energy. The Knight of Pentacles. Okay. We got the hanged man here. Now that this person or this obstacle or this snake or this setback or whatever this energy is, now that it's been removed or called out or defeated by God with your help or with by with you by you with the help of the divine, God, okay, it's this vibe where with the eight of cups and the knight of pentacles, something's about to return. We got the hangman. So this, whatever these obstacles were, the hangman, somebody's getting caught up for this. They're getting caught up for whatever slowdowns or obstacles they tried to send your way. It has something to do with your money or you being independent. Maybe they didn't want you to be independent. They wanted you to be depending on them. Confirmation spiritual belts. That could be a thing for real. Somebody wanted you dependent on them. Somebody was trying to make you look bad. They wanted you to look like you didn't... Like you were weak or something. Ill-equipped. Somebody could have tried to tie up your finances. Now their finances are about to be tied up. Whatever they was trying to do with that seven of pentacles energy, whatever seeds they was planting with that nine of wands and the reverse, it's like a vibe where whatever this is, it didn't phase you. The nine of swords is here. They're left in regret. They're being rejected. They could have wanted you in regret. They could have wanted you rejected. They could have wanted you to be left out or abandoned. They could have wanted you to miss, miss an opportunity or miss money. I feel like all that energy is being returned to this person, whoever that, whoever they are that sent you this attack. I feel like somebody sent you attack, an attack. But you took the soul out the snake or you took the head off this snake. You defeated them. I'm hearing single-handedly with the help of the Father, with the help of God. I'm hearing they tried to clone you. Temperance. They tried to clone an earth angel. Archangel Michael is here. You had God and Archangel Michael helping you.
Somebody is worried. The Chariot, King of Cups. Again, the Chariot confirming the Six of Wands. You're victorious out here. King of Cups, highly enlightened. Somebody got the message about you. Ooh, that's a lot of cards, but I'm going to look at them. Eight Pentacles. Eight wands, eight, eight, two of wands, and the queen of pentacles. Somebody was expecting to, like, take your abundance. Oh, but you, the bag is secure. The four of wands is there. You're secure. You're protected. You're too protected for whatever they was trying to do. Whatever this attack was to, to operation and take your abundance, um, you're too, you're too skilled. You're too skilled for this. They feeling foolish. You could feel like more tired than you normally do. It's because you've been in battle. It's okay. Just give in to the sleep monster. Just go night night. <laughs> go night night. Okay. Get you that. Get that rest. All right. Get that rest. It's definitely somebody feeling foolish. They feel exposed. The sun card is here. Overall energy, we're going to take that as the ace of pentacles at the bottom of the deck, the queen of cups. You're going you're gonna to receive some sort of um, gift. God is giving you something, rewarding you something, offering you something. He's handing it to you. This is a gift directly from the divine. You're also being crowned. The Queen of Cups is here. The Queen of Wands is here. The Eight Wands is here. There's a heavy burden being put down. The Two of Wands is here. Them Two Wands, that Eight Wands, that's Ten Wands. You're going to be celebrating something here shortly. Someone's trapped themselves. They hurt themselves. You can rest now. You're receiving peace. This person feels like a fool for battling you. <laughs> yeah, you're receiving peace. They see that you had you're like you're beyond you're beyond the towers that they could try to create for you. King of Wands. You bossed up, leveled up. Ace of Wands, you're, you're too powerful. You're more powerful than whoever this is. And you defeated them. Short and sweet. You took the soul out the snake. This has been your read. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll catch y'all next time. Wait a minute, where I'm going? Let me pull this um, short and sweet on it. Short and sweet. Thank you, angels and spirit gods, for clear and precise messages. What is this message for the short and sweet? You defeated somebody's spell work. It could have been a couple that was sending you some type of spell work. You defeated this. You defeated the both of them. Whew. All right, let's see. What's the message? Thank you, angels and spirit guides. What's the short and sweet for this read? It's okay to feel yourself. <laughs> it's okay for you to feel yourself, boo-boo. You done it. You did it. God did it, and you was right there with him. He was right there with you. Big stepper energy. At the bottom of the deck, we got sexual seduction. Somebody could have been doing some type of sexual magic on you. Big stepper energy, though. You out here. You out here. 
Okay, this has been your read. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll catch y'all next time. Bye.